after the timeout by Coach De Leon. Good pressure defense there by the prior. Forced to turn over. Uh, and there's a steal by Azalea Rodriguez. Swinging it over to Talamantes. Nice pump fake. Gets into the paint, puts up a shot. Oh, she calls travel. Navarez being pressured up front, swinging it over to Trevino. Have a timeout for Coach Bermuda, 30 second timeout. So after the 30-second timeout, the prior six, bracket two, two-three zone by the Tigerettes, trying to negate any kind of entry into Ortiz. The Forest puts up a three, and into the hands of Sidney Rodriguez. Over to Azalea. Salamantes, nice entry into the high post. Azalea Rodriguez picks up the foul. So Navarez is going to go coast to coast, puts up the shot, and in and out. <clears throat> Into the hands of Osleo Rodriguez coming back for the Tigerettes. 4.25 to go, brackets down, 6-2. to two. Talamantes grabs the pass. And back into the hands of Sidney Rodriguez. Talamantes high post to lob. She puts up a shot and in and out. And Morris tied it up with Ortiz. Navarez comes across the timeline being guarded by Lob. Nice skip pass. About an eight footer in and out. Talamantes for bracket and they're gonna have a foul by Carly Trevino. Salamantis <laughs> near side, lob in the short corner. Rodriguez, a long three. Ball inbounded to Moreno, comes across the timeline, cut off by Talamantes and Rodriguez. We have another timeout for Coach Bermuda, 30 second timeout. We'll be back in 30 seconds.
timeout. 3.25 to go. Navarro comes across the timeline. To Moreno. Another jump ball. Talamantes comes across the timeline to Rodriguez. Skip pass. So 2-1-2 two two zone by Bracket. So Ortiz gets her own putback offensively and puts it back in. So it's eight to two in favor of LaPriere. So foul gonna be called on Ortiz. Nice lob entry into Ortiz, but Brackett's waiting on it. She still gets her own rebound out to Moreno. She couldn't get a hold of it. Back out to Bermuda. She launches a long three <clears throat> into the hands of Talamantes. Turnover into the hands of Navarres for but prior, she puts up a runner and knocks it down. Talamantes comes across for bracket, gets into the paint, puts up a runner off the glass, and into the hands of Lopez. So 123 to go. So Gidry. Oh. So nice bucket there for the Tigerettes. Ten to four. Navarre, she's gonna go coast to coast. And Miss Ortiz with the putback rebound. Lopez with the back side rebound after the long miss on the three-pointer. 37 seconds to go in the first quarter. Carly Trevino is going to be called for the push. So... Childress, Lobb, Morris. Talamantes for the Tigers, along with Flores. Marley Flores just checked into the game. Swinging it back to the inside. Rodriguez gets up into the paint, puts up a shot, knocked it down. Sidney Rodriguez. And that's going to be the end of the first quarter. The prior 12, bracket six, will be back in 60 seconds from the Forge Hall Gymnasium at the Southwest Texas Junior College.
High School Basketball Invitational Tournament from Southwest Texas Junior College here in Ubalde, Texas. Thank you for tuning in. So the prior 12, bracket six, as we approach the noon hour. Two, three zone by the bracket Tigerettes. Sydney and Oslea Rodriguez up top on the zone. Morris in the middle. Talamantes on the far on near side block with Lobb on the back side trying to negate. Any entry to Ortiz. Ortiz is sophomore, six foot five, so she gives up a lot of height to everybody else. Rebound offensively by Sprawls. Nice hustle by Trevino. Moreno just inside the three point line. And Bob had it, but it went back into the hands of the fire. Puts up a shot high off the glass to Oslea Rodriguez. 6.59. Good hustle by Moreno to tie that up. First one's up and in for Talamantes. Give us bracket seven. <laughs> Ortiz with the rebound. Ortiz. Nice hands by Sidney Rodriguez. <laughs> Navarro's into the low post. Kicks it back out. And rebounded by Lobb from bracket. 6.19 to go. Bracket seven, LaPrior 12. And there's a loose ball. We're gonna have another jump ball coming up. Foul called is pressure defense being applied by Brackett. Ball coming back across the timeline is Navarres, 2 3 zone by Brackett Tigerettes. It's 12 to 7, Lapire. Again, they're trying to work it in to Ortiz with the 6-5 reach. But they're fronting and back, and Lobb and Morris are doing a really good job of making it difficult on her. Skip pass, 
over to Trevino. She puts up a shot from about 10 foot and knocked it down. So 14 for LaPire, seven for Brackett. And there's Navarro with the steal and deflection. She's gonna get into the middle, puts up a runner, and in and out. She's got really good English on that ball. She made some really tough shots yesterday. Long three-point shot. Good hustle by Leia Rodriguez, but she flipped it into the hands of Moreno. 446. Moreno into Ortiz. Rebound by Talamantes for Brackett. Oh, good pass by Talamantes to the backside. Recipient of that bucket was Sidney Rodriguez. Good play there by Talamantes to pen penetrate in the backside drop. Back up top to Navarez with Trevino trying to work that lob on the backside. Gets in the paint, and Navarez was blocked by Rodriguez. Moreno puts up a shot into the hands of 23. Mackenzie Lopez, she's going to draw contact. Subs coming in for both sides. So 15 now for the Bulldogs. Bracket nine, 340 to go. Skip pass to the near side. Flores puts up a shot into the hands of Ortiz. Just hit the front part of the rim and Moreno now, point guard, going to have Navarro on the far side to the right. And lob entry into Ortiz. So just too much reach in there for Morris in the block. So 17 now, the nine for the prior. Nice skip pass, lob in the paint. Morris. Morris again gets her own rebound and she draws contact. So foul is going to be drawn on Mackenzie Lopez. Nolani Morris is going to go to the line, sophomore. And coming back for one more shot. Second one on the way after they miss. And they're going to have the bucket made. And they're going to have a sub coming in for brackets number five. Waddle replaces Morris. With 2.55 to go. And Moreno brings the ball across with Trevino to her left and Navarro to the right. And the high post is Lopez and Ortiz working the low block on both sides. So just inside the three-point line, Ortiz. Nice job there by Miss Lobb on the backside. Hannah, she's in charge of trying to negate anything entry over the in the front and then behind it. They're doing a really good job, though, trying to negate the center to get that ball gives up a big reach. And Lob comes up with the deflection. 
And he got pushed to the ground. So Sproul's coming in. So 2.25 to go in the first half, and there's a steal by Navaris. Navaris put it up and in for two. So 19 to 10 for LaPryor. Talamantes coming back for bracket, puts up a runner, blocks by Ortiz. She picks it up, fires it up to Navaris. And Navaris is going to try to go into the paint. And ball blocked out of bounds or knocked out of bounds. The turnover into the hands of Barkett, into Lobb in the backside, and she draws contact. Foul is going to be on Lopez. So Lobb's going to the free throw line, 19 to 10. Barkett's behind by nine. First free throws up, and it's good. So McCaslett checks into the game for LaPryor. So Torino or Moreno now with the point guard duties. McCaslett out on the far side, near side, Navarres. High post is Sproul. She puts up a shot into the hands of Morris for bracket with the defensive boards. Ball swung over to the corner. Rodriguez drives into the paint. Oh, and got it to fall. Contact was drawn by 20. So Carly Trevino. Chance for the and one for Sydney. Puts it up and in, and it's good. So now it's down to four. It was up 19 to 10 at one point, so they've cut it down. So 117 to go. Moreno over to Trevino. Sprawls at the high post. Skip pass to Navarez. And Morris with the steal for Brackett. They're trying to get it into the low post, and Brackett's fronting and backing it, and it's caused a few turnovers here in the last few seconds. Back up top, Talamantes with just under a minute to go. Rodriguez, she's going to try that short corner again. Skip pass to Morris. And foul is going to be called on Sydney Rodriguez. So 50 seconds to go as Moreno pushes the ball up. 2-3 zone by the Barker Tigerettes. So now Morris is in the front. And Waddle's in the backside trying to negate any entries to Ortiz. Skip to the backside. Navarez, she gets in the paint, puts up the runner. In and out, off the glass, rebound to Waddle with 26 seconds to go in the first half. Bracket trailing by four. Ball swung over to Rodriguez, about a 13-footer. Knocked it down. So 17 to 19 with 11 seconds to go. As now Navarez has the ball. She can shoot and penetrate and drive. Oh, nice move to get in the paint. Puts up a runner. Knocks it down. 21 seconds. And that's going to end the first half. The prior 21 and bracket 17 be back in about six minutes from the Forge Hall Gymnasium at the Southwest Texas Junior College.
Ladies and gentlemen, don't forget about the concession stand located right outside the front door. The kinesiology department is putting together for you some snacks and drinks. I know they have a popcorn machine. You can smell it from time to time. They can play the game. And at halftime, visit the kinesiology department. They would appreciate it. And thank you for coming out and supporting all these teams in our 63rd annual high school basketball invitational tournament.
bracket now gets the opening possession. Talamantes over to Rodriguez, skip pass, and we're going to have a foul on Leslie Moreno. First shot by Azalea is good. And second is good as well. So 19 for the Tigerettes and 21 for the Lady Bulldogs. All swung to the near side. Back up top to Navarre's. He tries to get in the paint. He throws it off, off. And ball's gonna be deflected out of bounds. And pressure coming back up. Morris gets it up to Lob. Lob skips it over to Rodriguez. Oh, nice up and under move. And one, so we're tied up at 21 all. So 7.21 to go, we're knotted up at 21 apiece. Ball to the near side. For Trevino, Navarre's back to Trevino. She thought about a three, but pulled it back. Navarre's high post elbow extended, lob into the low post for Ortiz, and nice use of the backboard, and Ortiz knocks it down for two. 23-21. After that bucket for LaPrior. That swing back to the inside. Bob swings it back out to Talamantes. Over into the corner to Rodriguez. And two from about 14 feet out. Good shot. We're knotted up at 23 apiece. Sprawls at the high post, trying to work 2-3 zone. And there's a pass entry into the high post, but deflected off the hands of Sprawls into Morris for bracket. Talamantes coming across the timeline, skips it out to Rodriguez. And there's a steal, and we're going to have a foul by Azalea Rodriguez says the little one, Leslie Moreno from the prior, was going to be off to the races on that one. One team foul for each with two minutes gone by in the third quarter from the Forge Hall Gymnasium. Countdown to under six. Trevino back up top to Navarre Moreno on the right side. Puts up a three and rebound by Talamantes for the Lady Tigerettes. Shot by Rodriguez, used the backboard. Azlea Rodriguez, so back and forth, exchanging bucket for bucket. Lady Tigers, our Tigerettes are up 25-23, Navarre's up front. Swing pass, back up top. We'll have a turnover. 5.08 to go. Ball will stay in possession to the left-hand side for Ortiz works her way into the paint, gets her own rebound, puts it back up and in, and going to be fouled by Morris, I believe it is. Ortiz, sophomore, going to the free throw line. Good shot. Going to have a timeout coming up for Coach De Leon. We'll be back. Full timeout. We'll be back in 60 seconds.
And we're back after the timeout. Short corner back shot is rebounded by Lobb for the Barkett Tigerettes. Talamantes shoots the three and it's off. So ball's gonna go. So coming back across now for the prior is going to be Ramia. Skip pass over to Torino on their side. We'll turn over back to the bracket Tigerettes. Ball over to Talamantes. Rodriguez elbow short corner or high post corner. Ball comes out into the hands of the Lapara Lady Bulldogs. And skip pass over to Trevino. Her shot's out to Talamantes. I was going here. Morris with the rebound and Navaris. Was going to be off to the races, but had a foul called on Talamantes. Swinging to the near side is Trevino. Navarro over to the right side of hers. Trevino. Or excuse me, Moreno. Moreno to the right, Torino to the left, and also Lopez to the far right. Ortiz is working in the post. Four out, one in offense, but 2-3 zone by the Bracket Tigerettes with 3.20 to go. Doing a good job by the Tigerettes today. And there's a steal by Azlea Rodriguez. Goes to the corner and missed and put it up. And there's the little one. Azlea going to get foul, draw contact. Bulldogs coming back across the 238 to go. Navarro back to the near side to Trevino. To the right is Moreno. Good looking three. And there it was. Good release, good arc. A lot of times when you see the rotation on the ball, if you're able, not able to read the label, that's a good release. And that one was spinning like crazy. So that's where Nike came up with the swoosh back in the day. So swinging it over to the right side. The prior 27 to 25 got us a good ball game. Oh, nice skip pass over to Rodriguez. Swinging back up top to number 14, Flores. And Childress having trouble. And Navarro's skip pass the lob, high post elbow, balls deflected out of bounds. Sub. We got a sub. So Sproul's coming in for Lapire. And number five, Angelina Waddle for 
Barkett. So 27 Lapire, 25 Barkett. With a minute 50 to go, Sprawls puts up a shot into the hands of Rodriguez, and she's going to be fouled by Carly Trevino. And good shot there by Oslea Rodriguez. Second one on the way off the glass and counts either way. So 27 apiece in the third quarter. Got us a good one. Back and forth ball game. Swing pass to the near side to Moreno. Sprawls on the far side. Oh, and there's a pass picked off by Rodriguez. Oh, she double dribbled. Subs coming in now for Bracket. Talamantes coming back with Sydney Rodriguez replacing Flores and number 12, Hannah Lobb. Sprawl swinging it back up to Navarro's near side to Moreno, back up top, 2-3 zone by the Tigerettes. Making the ball moving and Lobb, Lobb pass. Oh, nice steal by Morris. That front and back set up by Coach De Leon is doing really good. Negating hers, but it's a good ball game coming up on 60 seconds to go. The third kicks it out. Good look at a three, and it's there. Back to back three pointers by both teams, and it's 30 for bracket 27 for LaPire. Got us a good one here on the consolation finals of the girls' side of the bracket. With 52 seconds, sprawls back up top to Navarre. She penetrates, gets in the paint, puts up a runner in and out, and there's Morris again. Back to back rebounds. 43 seconds to go. Bracket's going to come across the timeline. It is Talamantes. 2-3 zone by LaPrior. Got time to swing it back to Oslea. Sydney into the paint. Kicks it back to his little sister. Fires it up, and it's out into the hands of Ortiz off the glass. 26 seconds to go. Here comes Navarez. We know what she can do. She's going to go to the block and put up a runner, and we're going to have a block. Good call. Uh, she slid over. Navarre did that last year and did it every time I've watched her play. She's going to go hard to the block and draw the contact. She does have a good crossover, too, though, and can reverse finish on the other side, but a good move. A little too hard. So coming in for bracket, Marley Flores and Susie Talamantes coming out with 20.64. One's off too, and there's the little one, Oslea Rodriguez. Oh wow, what a play. <laughs> that, that was a good save there. 10 seconds to go. Rack it up 30 to 27. Uh-oh, gonna have a look at a three. She launches it up and she got fouled. Sprawls fouled her on the play, so we got three shots coming up for Sydney Rodriguez. First one's up and on the way, it's good for Sydney. <laughs> Second's on the way and it's good. Third, and she got the three point play. Regardless, three seconds to go, 33 to 27. Navarre's, it's good if it goes. Oh, and she knocked it down from the top of the key as the buzzer expires. Good shot by Navarre's. Going to be 30 to 34. Brackets up. We'll be back in 60 seconds.
We're beginning in the fourth quarter with three-point lead by the Bulldogs. The ball is inbound and into the top of the key. And number five, Rodriguez gets the ball down into the hands of number 20. Morris with the attempted shot, and then we're going back the other direction. The ball now is deflected into the hands of the Tigerettes, number three, Sidney Rodriguez. There's a jump ball called. The Tigerette with the possession was lob number 12 and was tied up by Ortiz, number 20. Inbound pass is being to the top of the key from Rodriguez. She drives into the lane, draws the foul. Susie Talamantes will go to the line shooting two for the bracket Tigerettes. Foul called against the Lady Bulldogs, number 20. Talamantes missed the front of the two-shot foul. Ortiz with the rebound after the miss, so 7.25 to go. Bracket up by three. Oh, nice steal by Talamantes for Bracket. Talamantes back over to Rodriguez. Ortiz. Navarez to the near side and to Trevino, opposite sides of Moreno. They're trying to work it in, but it's front and back by the Tigerettes. Sprawls puts up a shot and jump ball. Gonna get called for the foul. Violation. So Ortiz will get a chance to shoot another one. So Lapire 30, bracket 33 with 641 to go in the fourth quarter. Yeah! Nice by Ortiz to finish that one. So trailing by two now. The 2 3 zone by Lapire as Talamantes comes across the timeline. Swinging it to the far corner, skip pass back over to Bracket Talamantes, pump fake over to Rodriguez, blocked by Sprawls. Sprawls gets it to Navarez. Navarez, you know where she's going, off to the races. Oh, nice crossover left finish, and this didn't get it to fall. Caitlin Sprawls with the rebound. Gonna have a timeout coming up to Bermuda. We'll be back in 60 seconds from the Forge Hall Gymnasium.
And we're going to be back after the 60-second timeout from Coach Bermuda. Ball inbounded to Navarre. She gets up in the paint, puts up a runner off the glass. Into the hands of Rodriguez. We'll swing it back to the near side. Talamantes kipped over to Rodriguez. Talamantes back up top to Lobb. Puts up a shot and into the hands of Morris and Ortiz. Talamantes, oh. And Moreno swinging it back up to Sprawls. And then to Navarro setting it back up with 5.37 to go. 31-32, brackets up by two. Skip pass to Moreno on the line. Oh, wow. He was on the line for two, but a good shot. So we're knotted up at 33 apiece after that bucket by Leslie Moreno, five-foot freshman. So Moreno, Navarro up top for the Lady Bulldogs. Get past Talamantes up front. Lob at the high post. Norris at the low post. So now we're going four out when Norris is the sole post. Swinging it back over. Rodriguez puts up a three. Oh, in and out. Into the hands of Sprawls. Sprawls gets it over to Moreno. Swinging it back to Navarres. Gonna have a foul called on 20. So 4.39 to go in the fourth quarter. We're knotted up at 33 apiece. Ball over to Oslea Rodriguez. Up top is going to be Flores. Number one, Childress. And blocked by Trevino into the hands of Sprawls. So back up to Navarro's point guard coming across with 419 to go, 33 apiece. He tries in the paint. Nice crossover dribble blocked by Morris. Morris blocked into the hands of Childress. Now resetting it is Oslea Rodriguez. Both teams in a little bit of foul trouble, so having to use reserves. With four minutes to go, we're tied up at 33 apiece. Number 14, Flores drives up, puts a shot in the short corner into the hands of Norris. Morris swings it out, and a reset with 351. 2-3 zone by the prior. There, Childress is open on that far side, and then, then you have also Flores on the near side. Flores puts up a shot, looks good. Oh, in and out. Went around the world there, as I would say, and there goes off to the races, Navarro, and she puts it up and going to draw contact. So going to the line for two shots. Oh, she got the friendly roll. First one's in. So Lopez coming in for Sprawls. And then Talamantes and Lobb coming back into the game for Bracket. So rebound. So the prior 34, Bracket 33. Talamantes is back at the point guard duties. Swings it over to Rodriguez. Lob in the paint. Puts up a shot. And rebound by Trevino. So 3.15 to go as Navarro is going to come across. She's going to try to penetrate the top of that key. And there she went. Puts up a runner. Looks good. And it is. Knocks it down using the backboard. She's got a really good court awareness as she penetrates. Can go with either hand. Made a good move getting it off the glass. So up by three now. They're taking a lead after the 33 points that tied it up earlier. 
They're swinging it back to Talamantes and Lob to the near side. Talamantes got a good look at a three. Oh, in and out. And Lob gets on the floor. Good hustle by both players, Lob and Trevino. So, but the prior is going to come up with the possession arrow. So 33-36. Pryor is up by three. Still plenty of time in the ball game. It's been back and forth with both teams. Torino to the near side. Back to Trevino up top. Skipping across the side is Moreno. Ortiz at the low post. High post is Lopez. And they're going to try that entry. Skip pass. She's going to hit one of these threes eventually up top. And she's just inside the three-point line. In and out. Into the hands of bracket. We have a timeout for Coach DeLeon with 2.02 to go. We're going to have a full timeout. Be back in 60 seconds from LaForge Hall Gymnasium. With two minutes, dos minutos. As Talamantes comes across the timeline, trailing by three. It could be tied up after that one, and it is. So knocked it down for three. Good timeout by Coach De Leon to get possession. Ball into Ortiz over to Navarre. And we know where she's fixing to go. She's probably going to cross over, get in the paint. She puts up a runner, and it, oh. I tell you, she's one of the best point guards I've seen in a while. Being able to penetrate and dish and also cross over both hands. And then she went into the left and out back to the right on that one. Usually she goes to the left. But good move. Now the critical free throws when you're tied up is very important. First one looks good. And it is. Again, nice rotation is spent on the release on the basketball. So Sprawl's coming back in for Lopez. So we're ties broken. The prior 37, bracket 36 with 137 to go. In the fourth quarter, a chance to take the lead. Talamantes swings it over to Flores. Sprawls, or correction, Lob with the shot. 38 37, 120 to go. The prior Moreno gets across the timeline. Oh, there's a steal by Talamantes, and we're going to have a jump ball. So into the hands of Brackett. Oh, there's a deflection and a steal. So Flores goes... Have a foul on 14, going to be player control offensive. Using the elbow, got called for it. So 108 to go. 38 for Brackett, 37 for LaPrior. There's Navarre. Ooh. She's going hard at the bucket, puts up a runner, and it's out into the hands of Morris. Morris to Talamantes. Talamantes smartly. Oh, nice crossover. 
55 seconds to go. Nice skip pass, lob. Set it back up, Rodriguez, big shot, and it's out into the hands of, whoa, we're gonna have a foul. She took a good shot, I don't blame her, she was open. So it's 38-7. So Ortiz going to the free throw line with a chance to tie it up or take the lead. So got us a good one here with 47.32 to go. Well, the Pryor's down by one. Got a chance, like I said, to tie it up or take the lead, depending on the opportunities here. First one hits the front of the iron and it's off. Second one. On the way, and it's off the front of the rim. Sprawls with the rebound into the hands of Navaris. Navaris gets it. She's going to put up a runner in the paint and in and out. And we're going to have over the back on Ortiz. So Coach DeLeon is going to call a timeout, 30 seconds, to get grouped up with 39 seconds to go. Brackets up by one. We'll be back in 30 seconds. Oh, that was a chance for a steal. Norris going for her layup, and she gets fouled. Going up to the top. Foul's going to be called on number four, Caitlin Sprawls. To the line is going to be Morris. It's still one point lead with 34.86, 37 for Lapire, 38 for Brackett. So it's still anybody's ball game. Long way to go. Possession arrow favors Lapire, and they're also in the bonus. So big free throw coming up here. Oh, and she banked it in, but it counts the same way either way. Oh, that was Going to the inside. Navaris. Oh, in and out. And lob. Nineteen seconds to go, and we're gonna have a foul. Make sure that score is right. So seventeen point seven nine. And Talamante is going to the free throw line. They're up by two, with the chance to go to three or four. Second is up, and it's good. It's on the way. Got a full timeout coming up for Coach DeLeon and the Bracket Tigerettes. We'll be back in 60 seconds.
next shots for Talamantes coming up there, nursing a two-point lead, pushing it to three. If it goes in, it looks good, and it's out. And there she is, Navaris. Got a chance to go all the way. Got a person on the backside and puts it up. Oh, and we draw contact. Just couldn't finish. But big-time opportunity here to tie it up. A good foul, though, because she was going to have an uncontested layup, but good hustle. So Carly Trevino to the line. Ooh, missed the first. And Talamantes up with the board on that. Smart foul by Navarez. So still got time with 7.12. 7.12 to go, Talamantes. Chance to extend it to three. Oh, in and out. It's one of those the little gremlins on the rim up there. Couldn't help you out. Still a one opportunity possession either way if she makes it or misses. That one knocked it down. Three-point lead. There's an inbound to Lob. Going to Navarre. She comes across the timeline at five. Going to have a timeout coming up to Coach Bermia with .49. Got time to toss it up and shoot it in. We'll be back in 60 seconds. Time to lob it up there and catch and shoot. And that's going to be the end of the ball game. Final score, bracket 40 and LaPrior 37. Turn it over to Ricky with the public address for the all-tournament selection. for both these two teams, please. At this time, we'll have the presentation of the all-tournament selections from the LaPrior Lady Bulldogs. We're going to go with a sophomore, number 20, Merrick Ortiz. And from the bracket Tigerettes, we're going to go with a senior, number three, Sydney Rodriguez.
And at this time, we will have the presentation of the Constellation Champion. That goes to the Bracket Tigerettes. <laughs> All right, just a minute, I want to take a, a quick, my name is Lander Fowler, I'm the Physical, Physical Education Department Coordinator, and on behalf of Southwest Texas Junior College President, Dr. Hector Gonzalez, we want to present the uh, SWTJC Coaches Scholarship through the funding provided by the McKinsey Scott uh, Initiative Grant, and so each coach has had an opportunity to select a recipient um, they would be t potentially um, attending Southwest Texas Junior College, and I want to announce those two recipients from each team. So from Brackettville, we have Susie Talamantes. And then from La Prior, we have Caitlin Sprawls. Thank you. And just as a reminder, don't forget about the concession stand located right outside the front door. Thank you, Coach. We do have a refreshment. 